Hi guys, and welcome back to yet another Sims 2 Strange Town episode. In the last episode, it was the first ever one that we played here in Strange Town. If you want to catch these live, because everyone in chat is here, we're all having fun, and you want to be the first to see Strange Town when it comes out, I stream every single Saturday, 7 p.m. EST. I will stream two weeks of Strange Town, then swap over to one week of Pleasant View and like alternate back and forth. So in the last stream, we basically did all of the scripted events in The Sims 2, which are essentially tutorials. When you said it in the comment section of this video that all of these scripted events really seem like tutorials. If you have the clean template of Pleasant View, which I said Pleasant View, oh my gosh. If you have the clean template of Strange Town, these don't quite work as they are supposed to. They are a little bit different than how you're supposed to play the scripted events. We still did like the essence of the scripted event, right? With a couple of alterations here and there. Now in the last room, I did mention that I was going to renovate and change every single Sims household to the lovely build by Fratana, who is a lovely Sims 2 lot creator. And Fratana has gone ahead and changed every single lot in the Sims 2. It has no CC in it. I think Fratana's builds like by and large have no CC in them. This is the the brand new Spectre household. What I love about Fratana's builds is it keeps kind of like the structure and idea of the original EA Maxis build, but it builds on it and improves upon it. So this would have been a Olive's garden, but it is now kind of turned into this little sitting area out here with like a dead tree in the middle of it. It's nice, isn't it? And this is the inside. What I love about these houses is they're just so well decorated and it just looks cozy and, and nice and I love I love it so much so this is the new Spectre household I'm gonna go into the neighborhood now and show you guys the rest of the households I forgot to mention this also in the last stream but I am tracking all of this information on a spreadsheet so I can leave a link to that in the description box below on the YouTube video if you guys would like to also keep track of your Sims 2 Strange Town if you're playing along with me and you want to have a nice little organized space are the graves deleted so I moved Olive's graves to a let me show you I, I installed let me see if I can find it a memorial cemetery so the graves are moved, not deleted. What is the popularity token? So I don't know exactly what tokens do for Sims. Like I know that, for example, if your Sim has a hidden family token, they will have a higher chance of having um, twins, I believe, in The Sims 2 and triplets, if you have the triplets mod or whatever. I think they are just, they act as like a third aspiration. Someone in the chat can probably correct me a little bit more about this. But yeah, some Sims do have hidden popularity tokens or hidden family to tokens. For, think like Cassandra in Sims 2 Pleasant View has a hidden family token, which is why you're more likely to get twins on Cassandra. I moved the headstones, but not the bodies. What? Uh, Will says they have a higher chance of having twins and it pushes them to have family related wants and fears. Yeah, if a Sim has like a family token. This is where I moved all of Olive's kills because I feel like a few Celia would not want that <laughs> in her brand new house. So she has all of her graves here, just chilling out, all of them. And this will be our where I deposit of all the graves. I found this lot if you want it. I found this on Mob the Sims. It is a memorial cemetery. It's just like a really small lot. It's got a vampire coffin in the basement, which is pretty cool. It's pretty empty, not much here, but it is like supposed to be a, a mausoleum. Hidden tokens do basically act as a third aspiration, like you said. They roll the wants and fears of their aspiration tokens, as well as their actual aspiration secondary if those are ever that is so helpful thank you yes <laughs> idea for not playing some sims in pleasant view they moved to sim city if you guys don't know i also have a pleasant view playthrough on my channel and that town is very overwhelming because i have had way too many sims like it's just too it's too much it's too much so strange town is a really nice palette cleanser because it's not that many sims it's not too bad really it's it's manageable I mean, at the current state, we have like barely any Sims. It's definitely a, 
a step in the right direction okay so this is aj loner's household now uh, in addition to i'm not sure if I, oops i'm not sure if i did it with aj but i did do it with some of the sims i also changed all of their appearances so i did that all off camera because that's really monotonous and boring to watch i changed some sims's face templates if you don't know a lot of the sims in these pre-made towns are not genetically related i don't know if aj is or not but some of the sims in this town are not genetically related to their parents which makes no sense like the sim should have the genetics of their parents i think it's because they probably made these sims in create a sim versus actually rolling their genetics and importing the sims's face template that they pre-rolled using the parent genetics if that makes sense so a lot of these sims will look like template face this is a huge problem that plagues the Sims 2 Pleasant View. Like for example, Cassandra Goth doesn't have the mixture face of Mortimer and Bella. So you then have to go in and replace her genetic face so that she actually looks like Mortimer and Bella. It's the same thing here in Strange Town. Uh, a lot of these Sims don't genetically look like their parents because EA made them in Create a Sim. So that was what I was gonna mention, Rip. All of these Sims are not genetically related. The ones that I redid though, because a lot of you were talking about um, Polynesian PT the sim who abducts your sim so not the polynesian technician in the smith family but pt9 the alien that will come in the spaceship and abduct your sims as they're using the telescope i did end up changing pt9 npc pt9's face template and i also changed <laughs> pt9 smith's face template so he looks way different he's so cute and i love his ears he's got his alien ears and this this pt9 is actually genetically related to his parents i think right does he have parents on the family tree yes so he has colony drone 65535 is his dad and then birth queen which is so weird <laughs> birth queen <laughs> i don't know if i like that he is genetically related to the sim so yeah pt9 has a nose now thank god and yes his scary eyes are gone so this pt9 is related and he will make really beautiful babies with him and jenny um i want you guys this is my favorite house in the entire neighborhood this is the smith family what i love about them is they are the only house in this entire neighborhood to actually have a green yard which i think i feel like pt9 would wake up at like 6 a.m to water his front lawn it's so funny and this is once again these are these houses are all made by Fratana. they are cc free by and large and they're just they look so much better it's so cute and i love the greenhouse if you don't know in the last episode we read uh jenny jenny smith's bio and it says that her favorite color here is green which is kind of like a play on the fact that her husband and son johnny are green and her house is also green and i also tried to incorporate that in jenny's outfits so this is my jenny smith i didn't change up her face template at all this is what she comes with i obviously just have like some cc on her or whatever and i tried to give her a nice green dress where did i find their refixed face templates so i just googled like sims 2 strange town genetically correct faces and i have a video on actually how to replace their face templates once you find like a pre-mixed face um if you go to my visual guide update i show where i changed their genetically Correct face template. So I think a new baby is in the works here for PT9 and Jenny. Jenny looks like a model, doesn't she? She is gorgeous. I said this in the last stream. She is probably the prettiest sim in all of Strange Town. Like I would not be surprised. She is gorgeous. EA slash Maxes really did their thing here when they made her. And I also got new um, default eye replacements. If you guys saw the last stream, my alien eyes on the default eye replacements that I was using were really creepy. So I did end up reinstalling some that do not include alien eyes. And I also downloaded some brand new default replacement eyes and i think that they just make the eye look so much more detailed and beautiful pt9's here you can see he has like the regular schmegular alien eyes but just like the black alien eye instead of having the weird yellow eyes <laughs> oh <laughs> it's your profile picture wait it literally is your profile picture let me show you guys this bella goth fan page made their profile picture the weird little alien eye down there you can see it <laughs> it's creepy it is really creepy uh i don't like that this house just like it just seems so quaint and just like so 
peaceful peaceful and like calming i can imagine like jenny and jill just sitting by the pool one day as pt9 like gardens and you know waters his lawn and whatever so it just seems really peaceful but yeah this is pt9 he actually is extremely good looking now so let's move on to the next family so i could show you guys because we have a lot of families to cover so next up let's go over to the curious brothers house why not i can show you them and also show you their brand new house who did you not correct jenny i think jenny and jill and johnny and philia maybe i can't remember i i definitely did the curious brothers though so they'll look different here's laszlo I love his NASA shirt. Do you guys see his NASA shirt? It's got Simlish text on it. It's so cute. Yeah, Astro lost the alien eyes, thank God. I'm gonna give you guys the grand reveal for their house in, in a second. This was so weird. Pascal looks like Harry Potter. Does anyone else see this? Like, he looks just like Harry Potter with this outfit on. When I was in London in February, I saw Harry Potter and the Cursed Child, and the adult actor that plays Harry was dressed almost in this identical outfit. It's so weird. Like, I saw this and I was like, oh my God. And I love these new default eyes. I will also put them in the description box. I forget what they're called, actually. Oh, I did not mean to zoom in on his crotch. My bad. Because I know I'm gonna get some questions about the eyes. Let me show you my new default eye placements. Okay, here they are. Just in case I get questions, you guys can like look this up. Marigold lobster eyes convert to the Sims 2. They are so gorgeous. Look at these eyes. Beautiful. They just add like so much depth. I remember when Cursed Child book dropped that was working midnight release at Barnes & Noble. Ooh, that seems like a fun time to work at Barnes & Noble. <laughs> Nervous would be the type to have a Harry Potter looking boyfriend. He looks just like him, doesn't he? <laughs> um, okay, and then last one. Okay, I don't know why Loki's here. I did not default replace. Actually, I feel like I did default replace Loki. Maybe I didn't because his brow bone is still really messed up. You guys don't know if you, if you can see his brow bone here, he has like a really weird brow bone. It hangs over his eyes so much. He needs a default replacement. He's he's scary looking, isn't he? Wait, Cursed Child had a 60% return rate the next day. Oh my gosh. Well, I can't imagine why. It was not that good. But the play was amazing, really. <gasps> Vidkun's um, going to go throw. But here's Vidkun. Cute, isn't he? Look at him. I love his hair too. He just looks so good. I love. Loki is Loki kind of cute. Loki's brow bone is, is just so bad. His brow bone is actually genetic, so he can get it if he has a genetically correct. I think the person that I was downloading them from actually fixed it, so it's not as, like, extreme. Loki can't be fixed, I know. Vidkun is looking fly, isn't he? I love Vidkun. He looks so good now. One thing I know that Vidkun has, doesn't he have, like, a... Oh, he has a crush on Cersei. Who has the crush on Crystal Vu? Okay, here, Lazlo has a crush on Crystal Vu, and he's here with his niece okay so there is the curious brothers oh let me show you guys the house too because these are once again all made over by fratana so i know i know that the curious brothers original house is supposed to be like a research facility i know i tried to make sure that the house i was downloading still kind of kept that vibe i think it's cute and yeah fratana still kept the sidewalk pattern that they have that someone said that it's like they were summoning aliens like they're trying to get the attention of the aliens i'm i'm here for the change as well yeah did you use clean installer to put the houses? Yes, I did. So here's their kitchen. Here is their dining room. They have like a little stereo now. Yeah, I still think it looks lab-esque. It's just prettier now. They have a cute little, I love how they have like details of space everywhere. Like Fratana is really good about that. Keeping the general essence of the Curious Brothers and whatever. Look, they have a picture of a naked alien on the wall. Like that's amazing. They got pictures of aliens everywhere. See, Fratana is good at like keeping you know the de the small details and re-adding them around the house and whatever so here's the upstairs here's astra's bedroom it's so cute such a cute little room i love the windows too the it, the, the building is just so much better now here are all the bedrooms they also all have like double beds now because they didn't have double beds before i don't know if someone's bedroom is gonna get cut out because <laughs> they're gonna have a single bed <laughs> who's gonna get the little kids bedroom does this have cc most of fratana's builds do not have cc i don't think this one ha does okay so there are the curious brothers i know i want to live in this house isn't it cute that's been concerned you cannot change my mind <laughs> also downloaded brand new community lots so 94 roads nowhere i re <clears throat> i redownloaded and gave it well i didn't whoever did made it look all nice and stuff so this is my brand new 94 road to nowhere oh you can't move when you have that open that's weird here's the brand new 94 right is that isn't that what it's called 94 94 road to nowhere it's just so pretty this will be such a good place to have parties and whatever just so cute and then we have like public showers over here 
We have bathrooms and little massage tables and everything like that. It's just so much nicer. Mm -hmm. Birthday party paradise, yes. So here is my brand new 88 Road to Nowhere. This is another community lot. We have a little pet station over here. This is like a shopping plaza, I think, is what it's supposed to be. Here's a little magazine store. We have a little restaurant. I don't know why this has got a under construction sign. It's strange. I did download this. Yes, I did. Here's a little H&M clothing store and a grocery store. So it's nice. Looks a bit like a pawn shop. <laughs> I love those kind of vibes with this town though. Like I love that it invokes those kind of feelings because this is definitely like a small town sort of vibe. Tana's makeovers. For Tana didn't make these public lots, I don't think at least. I looked on the Sims 2 lot database for 94 Roads Nowhere and 88 Roads Nowhere, but the rest of the houses are done by for Tana, yes. Sims 2 lot database, I'm gonna put it in chat. I forgot an A and base database. That's where these public lots come from. All right, so after looking at those public lots, let's look at the brand new, who should we look at next? Should we look at the curiouses? Should we look at the singles household? We added this in the last stream but i did makeovers for the single girls they are so beautiful guys i'm gonna have such a fun time i love playing with female sims i shouted this from the rooftops i have so much more fun playing female sims than male sims look at these girls here is Kristen. oh they're all sick right so i think one of them went to a party and just has gotten everyone else sick but here's Kristen. so gorgeous here is lola I also gave them outfits according to their personalities. So apparently Lola is like more quiet and she's very like studious. Whereas her sister is like a daredevil sort of like party girl. So this that's kind of like the outfits I gave them according to their personalities. So as you can see, I gave Chloe here like an 80s like updo with kind of some fringe and some like teased pieces and everything like that and then over here we have Erin who has blonde hair to me so I feel like she'd have freckles just because she has blonde hair the freckles might be too dark for her skin but that's okay I have lighter freckles too in case I don't know they look fine from far away right Erin's so cute though like look at Erin she's just adorable I love her oh Erin Erin's face I think I default replaced I believe so that's why she might look different than, than you. Lola and Aaron are my kids. Yes. <laughs> from Stranger... Eddie from Stranger Things. No. <laughs> no, not Eddie from Stranger Things. It just makes me think of like all those cringe TikToks that people uploaded like trying to be Eddie. Ugh. It gives me the... It gives me the ick. <laughs> I'm at the lot database and I have a lot of good renovations. Yeah. Yes. I think the freckles might be too dark for, for Aaron, honestly. But anyway, here's their house. I showed this in the last stream. Um, we already... already like this is from Fratana. I think I showed this before, but this is what their house looks like. Happy I don't own TikTok. Have you thought about streaming more than once a week? I've thought about it. I've like played with the idea. I don't know, I think it's hard too because I, I do upload three times on YouTube and then I'm trying to look for a job you know, my first ever entry level job. I'm trying, I'm really trying to look for a job, y'all. It's so hard. it's so tough out here. So next up we have the Grunt family. I don't think I gave them new clothes at all. I think I just replaced their home lot. Let's check out their brand new house, their brand new Grunt household. Oh, I think I might've default replaced General Buzz's face. Listen, guys, I cannot remember who I did and who I didn't, I'm sorry. So here's their brand new house here. It very much so is in Fratana's style. Fratana loves the brick. Remember when Tank showed up with the midriff and low riding plant fans in the last <laughs> episode i know so here's the kitchen here's like the walkway the entry the foyer area these stairs kind of freak me out because they have little kids i feel like hey maybe general buzz will be like this is a good training for you guys not to fall through the stairs <laughs> He uses it as like a training device, the stairs. Here is their workout area, little living area. Upstairs, finally, General Buzz got a double bed. Thank God, if you don't know, in, in his default house, he has a single bed, which is like, why? Why do you have a double or why do you have a single bed? When he said it was because he, you think he sold it when his wife left him. And then we have little Buck's room. Over here, we have one of the boys' rooms. I don't know which one is which yet. Tank, I know Tank is like one with the face paint right and then rip is like the other one and then over here we have another boys one of the teenage boys bedrooms i can't decipher like whose room is whose based i guess i could read their personalities rip is, totally doesn't care what you think of him he is going to do whatever he wants to do which is mostly what everyone else is doing and then tanks is like tank wants to be just like his older man he spends his days lifting heavy things dodging imaginary bullets and being bigger than the other guy i think this must be his room right yeah the one with the weights yeah that's what i think too there is the brand new 
grunt house and then i think we have one more we have the beaker household to look at and i think the beaker household was the one that got the most change because nervous doesn't sleep in the basement anymore the beakers finally gave poor nervous their own bedroom his own bedroom the whole house looks different the whole the whole Beaker family household looks so different. Do you have Indeed in the USA? Yes, I do. We do. I almost got scammed on Indeed. Like they, people post fake jobs and whatever on Indeed. So here is the Beaker house. Finally has closed off rooms so that it isn't like super cold. I guess because we're not playing with winter in this, it won't get like super cold. But here's the kitchen area. Here's like the living room area. It's the general essence of the Beaker family, but at least Nervous has his own room. So this is Nervous's room over here. He's got a computer now. Here's Cersei and Lo uh, Loki's room and a bathroom, a little living area. And yeah, just like really nice. Who made this house? Fratana. Fratana on Tumblr. You can Google their name. You know, it's a scam when they want to do some interview with a random text app. Yeah, Indeed is like, I can't believe Indeed has scams on it. Like really? So those are all the brand new houses that I installed in the game. So that means it is finally time guys to start our first ever rotation in the sims 2 are we excited oh also i need to change the weather how do we do it do i go up here look at the season button to choose the seasons oh <gasps> the fact that they did this is so cool like they really were thinking light years ahead good innovation ea honestly what a good idea okay anyway so that means we are going to be playing the curious family first and foremost i'm excited to play them i'm nervous as in the subject variety. All right, so back here at the Curious Family, I have to decide how many days we're gonna play them. Oh, we need some soups. We need, someone needs to make some grandma's comfort soup because everyone in this household's sick. Might have to finally finish up my Strangerville CC conversion song. Yes, please do. Maybe their Jenny, their sister can come over and cook them some comfort soup. That's a good idea. Let's get Jenny over here. It's such a good idea. Okay, so Jenny, let's look at the family trees. Someone told me in the comment section to always look at the family trees of these families. So Jenny is Pascal, Vidkun, and Laszlo's half sister. No, she's their full sister. I guess Lola and uh, Lola and Chloe are their half sister, right? They call over their sister stepmom. <laughs> yeah. All right, let's go and call over Jenny. We need some comfort soup in this household. And also, if you guys know the their secondary aspirations please let me know because i know a lot of you have their secondary aspirations memorized by heart i also need is pascal's actually so if anyone knows pascal's secondary please let me know because we got to fill that out pascal's romance oh no i don't think i can do i don't think i could do secondary pascal romance it just feels wrong to me i feel like he's a family man like you know he had his baby daughter and it changed him for the better so he's gonna be, oh, he can make the comfort soup now. He's gonna be family. I see him as a family sim. I think I filled out everybody. So Vidkun is family, yes. And then Laszlo is pleasure. Yeah, we got everybody else. All right, we're gonna call over Jenny. And I know that, I know that Pascal can make the comfort soup, but Jenny's a mom. So I know that, you know, moms by and large can cook, What right? <laughs> Jenny feels like to me, she'd be like the perfect housewife. Oh, she's gonna invite somebody. She asked if the, <gasps> hello? Um, Pascal, your baby's like on the ground. Hello. Pascal, she got nervous is wrong. I agree with you. All right, I don't know why Astra is just thrown on the ground. <laughs> oh man, okay, who's coming over? Oh, is it Ophelia? Did Jenny and in Jenny invited Ophelia. Okay, let's uh, let's let's just greet everybody. Come on in. Can't believe Pascal just threw her on the ground. I'm sad now. I didn't think that Jenny really knew Ophelia, but I guess she's like, hey, can I come over? <laughs> All right, I'm gonna take control of Jenny and mama jenny is gonna make i guess it's their sister but you know she's a mom so she's also mama jenny um we're gonna have her make up some comfort soup for everybody everyone in this household's sick <clears throat> what is that noise oh he's playing with the synthesizer whatever this is called perform random tracks okay this is gonna need to be deleted i can't stand when sims use this object i hate it so much make a soup yeah um i'm gonna turn off child support for astra just because it seems a little silly i don't think that pt9 is sending you know i guess polynesian technician i keep i keep saying pt9 i don't think it's technically pt9 it's pt oh i also got a default replacement of polynesian technician so he's a lot cuter if you guys can see that here i forget who made him it was on Malta sims i don't know Get that interstellar coin. 
he's like sending it and it just like falls you know when your sim gets a genie lamp and they get like those giant bags of plumb ball or uh what am i saying simoleons they just like fall in front of your sim it's like that all right jenny's making some nice soup jenny wants to resurrect lila which is interesting isn't that interesting i wonder if they were like friends or something i oh, know that wouldn't who would lila be in relation to her nobody right that wouldn't be anybody in relation to jenny she just wants lila correct someone can correct me if there's like a relation there oh we have some neighbors coming over oh look aaron's here kristen's here and aj's here pulling up all right let's everyone wants some everyone smell the comfort soup from a mile away and they all want it oh look she's like waiting or i mean he's waiting for jenny to put it down <clears throat> yeah bella is not in the clean template at least the one i installed i don't know do we do we add bella i feel like i've reached my limit with bella because she's in pleasant view and it's like she's there for no reason she kind of just like pops up every now and then i don't know party at the curiouses exactly laszlo and aaron are a great pair. i'm thinking about having laszlo um get with crystal vu he's a crush on her already so ash just crying she needs her diaper changed i think yep Pascal's like, I gotta eat some food first before I take care of my daughter. This is a clean template? Yes, it is. Ooh, Bella and General Buzz is really interesting. I like that pairing, actually. Oh! AJ's getting quite comfortable with Erin over here. I need to change her freckles. They are just too dark for her skin tone. I, I think I have, like, paler freckles that I can give her. They're just too dark. I fear. Oh my gosh, the TV is like blaring my ears out. Do, 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 do. I think add her so the beakers can kidnap her. She's the abduction queen. That was like, I can fix him. They look fine in this mode, but like when you take her out into live mode, they look a little bit too dark for her. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna give her these ones. These ones are a lot lighter. Let's see. Oh, that is so much better. Look how... That looks so much better for her. Yeah, much better. <clears throat> All right, Pascal, it's time to go take care of your daughter. <laughs> She's just like crying upstairs. I half expect one of our party guests to uh, take care of her. Look at Vidcon and Ophelia are chatting out here. They seem like a really good like friendship pairing. I like that. <clears throat> and he's chilling. I'm gonna make her unselectable now that she's made us some soup. All right, what's going on here? He's just chatting with his sister. He needs to go use the restroom, take a bath and stuff. I didn't even check their jobs. So Vidkin's a lab assistant, Pascal's a lab assistant, and Laszlo's a field researcher. That is so on brand for all three of them to be in science, my God. <laughs> I like Kristen. Kristen's like the cutest one, I think, out of the singles household to me. She's just so cute. Look at her. I love her outfit too. It's just so stylish. Those new eyes made such a difference, to be honest. They look more realistic. I agree. Like they just had like a lot of depth to the Sims' face. Oh my gosh, that scared me. Thank you for the save. I will save. I move nervous with the curious and the beakers have a baby to replace him. I'm sure they will, honestly. How do you use the autosave mod? So it's in your miscellaneous miscellaneous in here. And I like to put it, I mean, I like to put it under the house, but they don't have like an underside of the house. So I'm just gonna put it on the roof so it doesn't um doesn't affect anything. I just like to hide it. <laughs> and then I'll come up here and I'll just click on it. You can change the autosave frequency. It's however many hours you want. Let me do it with someone that doesn't have anything queued up. So the food cost is gonna be however many hours. So every 12 hours, my game will auto save just by itself. And there you go. That's just how you do it. The way Laszlo is higher in the career than his brothers, even though he got a degree in psychology, thinking it would give him telepathy. I have tried that cheat, yes. I have mine in my, what's it called? I have it in my, user config file the oh no user startup cheat file i have mine at 0.3 boat prop tv volume 0.3 and here you guys can see this here let me show you 
I, I swear I have it in there. It just doesn't do anything. It's still too loud. <laughs> my, my TV is still too loud. I, mean, I can try and type in the cheat, but... I don't know. I already have it in my startup cheat, so will that do anything? We'll see. You can put it at 1. Alright, let's try point 0.1. Yeah, that's much better. It immediately just got, like, much quieter, I think. But I don't know why they made the TV so loud in this game. It's crazy. Then who wants to flirt? Wait, does he? Oh, he does. Okay, wait, who's over that he can flirt with? Um... What about the single sisters? Or the single... <laughs> I call them sisters. The single girls. Where are they at? Kristen was around here. What if we try... What if we try Aaron here? Let's see if they have any chemistry. I feel like he'd get with Aaron just to piss off Loki. Like, that just feels like... That just feels like a vibe. Oh! Oh, AJ apparently wants <laughs> Aaron. He's, like, looking... He's, like, looking to the side, like, damn! She's cute! Oh, I guess Pascal didn't like Jenny's food too much. Because he's cooking his own food here. Some his, some hot dogs. Oh, she just complimented him. Oh. Okay. Um, that was a little bit... That was a little bit iffy. I don't know. I don't know how to feel about that. Let me add also ACR adjuster just in case, you know. We love a good ACR adjuster moment. I just pop it right here in the corner. Just so it's there. Um... <clears throat> You watched not Malcolm on YouTube. He shouted you out in his newest video. Really? I watched his video yesterday, but not today. Cause I know there was one also released today. I'll have to watch it later. <clears throat> okay, so let me see here. They're still chatting. Oh, they have negative chemistry. All right, well, that's a bust. Cause you the Sinister Queen. Oh, that's so sweet. That is really sweet. I appreciate that. I have to watch it later. I, I definitely will. I've I've watched his videos for like a while now. Oh, here's here's Kristen. Jeez, I was wondering where she went. All right, let's have Vidcon chat with Kristen. Oh, okay. We have a lot of Sims over at our household right now. So in the last stream, if you did not watch, I re-rolled every Sim in the neighborhood's sexuality. Wait, why is P why is PT9 here? He's he's walking by. He heard from a mile away with his with his sharp alien ears here. He heard that his wife was complimenting AJ, and he's on the prowl now. He's on the prowl. <laughs> he's listening. He heard her compliment AJ and he's like, I gotta, I gotta check this out for myself. All right, so uh, PT9 is straight. Obviously he's married to his wife. Aaron is straight low. Kristen is straight low. AJ is straight low. Jenny is straight. Ophelia is straight. Vidcon's straight. Pascal's gay. Laszlo's straight. Astra's baby, doesn't matter at this point. And wow, I did, you know, thank you for the hydration. I did a... 15%. What, what was our what was our consensus? Let me get a drink here too. We had a very high proportion of bisexual and gay sims and they're just not showing up. Okay, or, or it cannot like pop up. I think they have to have nothing in their queue in order for this to pop up. Oh, here we go. Okay, so we have in our hood 12% gay and 12% bi. And then for females, we have 12 gay, 15 bi. But I have yet to come across any of these female sims that are gay or bi, so... Anyway, that works out. I was gonna say that works out for Vidkin though, because him and Kristen could have some... could have something going on here. I rolled for every single sim. Every single sim. Oh, they're not getting long. Yes, one bolt with Kristen. That is interesting. Um, let's have him try to impart some knowledge on her. <laughs> some logic. I'm sure she wants it. Go and impart some knowledge on her. See, he can teach you things, Kristen. Oh, she's kind of looking at his crotch a little bit. Look at where her eyes are. Um, hmm, interesting. Yeah, Lafayette's attack has not been added yet to my game. I'm waiting for one of our Sims to want to go to college. Hmm. They couldn't Bella would be interesting. They've been eating hot dogs for like 10 hours straight. Oh my god. I feel like I'm trying to chat with Pascal. I'm gonna have him get up because if Ophelia what Ophelia wants, Ophelia gets. I love Ophelia. Alright, Fitkin's getting so tired. I'm gonna have him go eat this hot dog real quick. Let's see if he can let's see if we can get him. She's into him? I guess I'll have to ask her what she thinks of him. You like what you see. Let's ask him. Let's ask her that. Oh, that did nothing for his hunger. 
I like how we made soup and hot dogs and everyone ate both of them and we're still hungry. Oh my gosh, Jenny. Girl, time and place. Why is this like half of a cello? It's like half of one. AJ's over here. AJ and Aaron, I think would be such a cute couple. Like AJ is so cute. Did you know this? Oh. Do you like what? Oh, I forgot. Oh, he, she likes blonde hair. Wait, I want to see what she thinks of him. Like, how many bolts does she have with him? Oh, okay, one. But she has more with AJ, of course. Everyone is going to have more bolts with AJ just because it's AJ. They could be an item, but I think we can find someone better for him. <laughs> Soup and hot dogs. My stomach is bubbling thinking about it. Hot dogs? Just, I don't know what it is about a hot dog, but it just grows. I mean, I don't eat real meat, but I don't even think if I ate meat, I would eat hot dogs. Here's the thing. Before I became vegetarian, I became vegetarian when I was 12 years old. So I don't even remember what life was like before that point. But yeah, I don't know. I don't think I would eat hot dogs even then. I don't know. Kind of just grosses me out. Thinking about how it's like mystery meat. Oh. Oh, Lazlo! Lazlo just trying to kiss Ophelia! Laszlo, hello? Um, I have no words. Got rejected for first kiss by Ophelia. Yeah, you did, you weirdo. Jenny needs to stop playing this instrument, please. For the love of God, Jenny, please stop. My ears are bleeding. <laughs> please, Jenny, stop. I beg of you. Yeah, you get no tips, girl. You're not very good. Oh, she got 20. Who, who tipped her 20? It was AJ, 100%. <laughs> Lazlo's feeling quirky tonight. I can't believe that. He tried to hit on Ophelia. Hmm. Let's see. Lazlo's turn-ons are... Oh, he's crying. Well, you're being weird. You are being weird. Look, everyone's like watching TV together. How cute is this? Little party at the Curious House. So cute. But he... Oh, okay. Didn't know y'all were like that, but he just he just saw his brother on the toilet and just walked back out. Okay. Oh, there is another bed down here. I didn't see this bedroom. Who should we give what bedroom? We'll give this one to Vidkun, why not? And then Pascal should have one near Astra's room. So we'll send him up here and then we can give this one to Laszlo because he's quirky like that. I'm actually not gonna send them to the bed yet because they're not that tired. <clears throat> Not Laszlo giving me the egg. No, literally. I love just like seeing what these sims do. Oh my gosh. This needs to go. <laughs> this cello needs to go. I cannot. Laszlo tried it again. Y'all, he tried it again. Boy. Boy, you need to stop. You need to stop. Laszlo. He has such a crush on Ophelia. My God, he's so down bad. He has two bolts with her. Oh my God. He is so down bad for her. Mm -mm, mm -mm. He is not buzzing. He is not. Jenny is just so sweet. She's like complimenting everybody. She could hate them and she would still, she would still compliment them. Oh. Lazlo's crying in the background. He's just bawling because of Ophelia. Yeah, well, you deserve it. AJ is just hitting on everybody in typical AJ fashion. <laughs> AJ is going to be the town. I think Lazlo is going to be the town weirdo. Like, he's just creepy. Dude, you're creepy. Why are you kissing Ophelia? Did my crystal boo over to distract him? Should we? All right, we'll call her over. He needs, you know, he just tried to kiss Ophelia. Don't know how to feel about that, but his homeworns are wild. Yeah, it's just, you know, it's that time of the month for him. Ah, yikes, yikes, yikes. We'll invite Crystal over. When will he learn? He tried it twice. AJ's giving me Dawn vibes, yes. <laughs> Laszlo's the next Dawn verb. True. He's still crying. Like, if I were Ophelia, I would be... I'd be out the door, just no. Now she's gossiping with Pascal. Oh, did she, he does not like Kristen, I think. Did he check her out? I think he just got like the like the shivers, the, sh the shiver animation that they, that they do. All right, let's see, where's Crystal at? 
Usually Lazlo and Crystal have no chemistry or negative. Oh, we'll have to see here. All right, we're going to greet Crystal. He is wearing those Jeffrey Dahmer glasses. If she gets such a kiss, I would have freaked out. Same. So here's Crystal Vu. She's just like a townie, I think. So she's, he's like crying. That's crazy. I cannot believe you're crying in her face. I'm going to give her a quick makeover because she's looking a little busted. I also need to default replace that hair. So someone remind me. Someone remind me later on Discord to default. Why can't I gussy her up? Hello, where's my gussy there? It is gussy up. All right, so here's Crystal. She needs some work for sure. She has potential, but she needs some new hair. She needs like some eye. She has no eye. She has negative eyebrow. <laughs> needs some eyebrows for sure. Um, let's see what I can give her here. She looks much better with some eyebrows. Let me tell you, she's a pretty sim. I think she kind of looks basic a little bit to me. Big forehead. She needs some bangs. We'll give her some bangs. She also has that like super bright blonde hair. So I give her some darker eyebrows, hopefully. These are, I think these are brown eyebrows actually. This hair is cute on her. It doesn't really cover her forehead though, which is really what we're after here. This hair is so, these little buns on her are so cute. Someone was asking about where I got this hair the other day. I don't know, wait, who's it by? P-M-N-G, Nusia Chun-Li, that's the hair name. I kind of like curly hair for her. Oh, I love this hair so much. I know it's clay and you guys like are anti me mixing clay and Max's or um, Elsa hair together, but I this is my favorite. These two right here, my favorite clay hairs ever. This one's cute too. She has the same template. Wait, does she have the same template as Benjamin Long? Oh, that just, that just, no. No, I don't like Benjamin. <laughs> I mix clay and Max's too. Yeah embrace the clay see i don't think i could do a whole game with clay i don't know what it is oh this is a nice hair for her she looks like your friendly girl next door honestly so her top lip is negative but that's okay because i'm gonna just give her something like this and it makes it appear as though she has bigger lips than she does i have yet to see a sim besides johnny i y'all y'all are hear me ride for johnny i love johnny i'm his ride or die okay Besides Ophelia, of course. I would just love to hang out with him, Ophelia, and Johnny. I feel like I also have a crush on Johnny, so like, I don't know. He's just one Sam I have such a soft spot for. So we, when we play Johnny, I will probably give him lots of attention, okay? Okay. <laughs> I feel attacked as a clay creator. No, no, I would have clay hair. Listen, I like the clay style. I do, I really do. Um, I was mixing them for a long time and then people were like, Maddie, why are you mixing your hairs? Eh, I don't like that. And I was, then I felt self-conscious about it. So then I stopped mixing clay hair and, and alpha hair together. So there's nothing wrong with clay hair. And in fact, I like to mix them, but a lot of people of my community judge me for it. So I don't do it anymore. Okay, there is the brand new Crystal Vu. She looks so much better now. And I'm going to change her outfit. I think this hair is like a different kind of isn't this like a different kind of hairstyle like a different hair texture thingy not hair texture um shininess texture i don't know all right i'm gonna give her this shirt because it's cute and i just downloaded it so i want to use it look how cute that is like come on she needs some new pants my god <laughs> i can't send these pants who remembers when cassandra wore see th these people in my audience like to judge me for the clay hair leave me alone I like it personally. I think I'm gonna give her these white shorts. These look cute. This is kind of a weird outfit. She has like a long sleeve shirt on with shorts. I feel like everyone in this town should be wearing shorts because it's gonna be summer 24 seven. That just will make sense to me, right? It's so Y2K. I think I'm gonna change the shirt, honestly, cause I wanna use the shorts, but I don't like the shirt with this. Let's give her, ooh. A little crop top moment. Maybe not a crop top. Maybe something like this or let's see. This shirt could be no, because she has white shorts on. I want to give her like a white shirt and shorts. We'll do this one. We'll do this. And then here's her outfit. Cute. Wait, she has no shoe. She has no shoes on, y'all. It's it's fine. She can have her floor slappers out. One of what do you call them? A floor slapper, I think. So that's that's what we call them now. 
<clears throat> does she have a crush on him too? Let's check. I think she does. I think it's mutual. Oh, she doesn't. Oh, it's one-sided. Oh, that's embarrassing for you, Laszlo. Yeah, he's gonna be the town. He's gonna be the town weirdo. The ground grippers. Yes. He's gonna be the town weirdo. You know, he he can't get any girls. No one wants to kiss him. No, 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 no. <laughs> it's not Laszlo's day. It's not. Uh, default eye suggestions. Here are the ones that I'm using in my game, Brad. Here you go. I'll link them in chat for you. Here, here are my old eyes. Oops, I typed eye singular. There are my old eyes, but I changed them just now. Well, for stream. Lazlo uses the telescope to spy on women. Why can I see that? Why can I actually see that? Lazlo has officially been voted as Strange Town's number one incel, making him tonight's biggest loser. No, seriously, he's so weird. Like, leave the. Please, leave Ophelia alone. Please. Pascal's like sleeping on the couch. Okay, I think I think it's time for everyone to leave. Oh, hey, Laszlo, is Pascal the? Yes, he is. Thank you for calling. Changes turn ons. He has like he is like stink as one of them. Wait, really? Oh, he does. Where's my sim blender? I'm just gonna replace this one. Yes, Vidcon is pregnant. You are correct. He is currently pregnant. All right, let's change his likes. Uh, where is he, Laszlo? If you don't know, in Sims 2, these are generated if town... I don't know when... When were turn-ons and turn-offs added? Does anyone know? What pack... Is that free time or seasons? I don't know. But, um... So these are randomly generated. So Laszlo does not like gray hair, which means he doesn't like old people. He likes great dancers and we're going to have him like, I normally like to do a roll one through four for a hair selection color. So I'm going to go to number generator and just roll one through four so you can have like a hair color that he likes. He got a four, which means he likes black hair. I don't know who, what female sim likes black hair or has black hair, but we will figure it out later. They're both blondes, yeah. <laughs> They're both blondes. I feel like he's chilling on the floor. Okay, this baby, this poor child, like Laszlo's over here just gossiping on the phone with nervous. And his baby's upstairs just crying. He's like, hold on. My baby's upstairs bawling her eyes out. Bella, yeah, Bella has black hair. Okay, it is like 1230 at night. I get that we're all having a good old time, but we need to leave. Everyone, please leave. <laughs> Everyone, please get out of my house. Please, let's say goodbye to everybody. Um, oh, yeah, we can change. We can change. Uh, or check, not change, but check Crystal's sexuality. She is gay. Low. Okay, so there is the first female gay sin that we have seen. It's been, a, it's been a minute. But yeah, so that's why she doesn't have a crush on Laszlo anymore. So Laszlo has a one-sided crush on Crystal now. <laughs> he has a one-sided crush on Crystal. That's unfortunate for him. Yeah, Lazlo turned her... Yeah, see, even Crystal got the ick from, from him. So that's why, you know, that would make a lot of sense. <laughs> We've only found one, and it's Lazlo's girlfriend, yes. Oh! He got his first bump! Yay! Congratulations, Vidkun. So now Vidkun is going to be having his little alien baby soon. Yeah. What happened to Ophelia? What do you mean, what happened to Ophelia? <clears throat> Crystal's cute, isn't she? I love her. You should make a Servio to date because at this point, <laughs> this robot is the only chance of love. <laughs> oh, Lola has black hair. True. That is very true. All right, Pascal's taking care of his little baby. Um, I'm gonna have him serve up some some toaster pastries. Vidkun is just so hungry because he's pregnant. She's pretty much giving Regina George that makeover. She has no shoes on. She's like one of those people. Oh, Jenny is like stinking up the place. She's like Crystal's like one of those people that doesn't wear shoes anywhere. You know those people, those those uh, nature people. <laughs> she she has no shoes on. <laughs> She's just walking around barefoot. 
Wait, Lazo is his sister. Or Lola is his sister, I mean. Laz Lola is Lazo's sister. Who said that in chat? <laughs> Who said that in chat? <laughs> awkward for me king listen i re i relied on you to give me the info now you're suggesting laszlo date his sister <laughs> it's easy to forget it is yeah it is honestly she's trying to connect to the ground through her feet true i know i'm ashamed of myself <laughs> all right vidkin's almost up he wants to meet aliens like he already has though so i don't know why this wish is not completing itself hmm dude astra is so high in maintenance she keeps needing like everything wait how is she her half how is he how is how is she his half sister i think is what you mean to ask uh lola is laszlo's half sister because their father Glarn Curious got abducted by PT9 and pregnant twice. Well, I think they were twins, right? They're twins. So it was only once. That's how. They have the same father. Yeah. <laughs> Would be a Maddie stream. No, usually it's like I forget that they're cousins or something. And I'm like, oh, right. They are cousins. And I just suggest that they get together. That's weird. It's always forgetting like relations i think what it is in the sims 2 it doesn't show you know how in sims 3 it sh you mouse over it and it shows you like oh they're sister-in-law or cousins or half siblings in the sims 2 it just says family so you would then have to go into the family tree and like work through the relation you know what i'm saying i do have a polynesian technician default replacement yes i downloaded it off malta sims he's a lot better looking let me show you guys the one i downloaded here is what our aliens will look like by the way now very handsome he's very handsome it kind of looks like a little bit of template face but that's okay i'm gonna link this in the discord if you guys want to use it i'll also put it in chat here's my pt default vidkin wants to flirt per usual i'm thinking about sending him to a public lot maybe to get something to eat so we can kind of get out of the house <laughs> last one can go creep on girls in the public public pool i was in school omg 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 thank you Namtros. i appreciate it i i i read your message as laszlo can go creep on girls at the public school and i meant public pool <laughs> no oh my gosh that was a slip up for sure <laughs> he's creepy but not that creepy yeah he's not that creepy but he's still creepy jail prison straight to the penitentiary okay so pascal just went to work so we're gonna go to the public not not school and we're not also not going to the pool i'm gonna go take him to this new little this little diner i don't know if this is a diner restaurant i guess so are you following any rules no i'm just playing like you know legacy style i guess oh lola's or chloe's here why don't you dine with your sister they're just like eating food like across this is stupid go sit with your sister vidkun what the hell i'm gonna have them join a group together it's like, why would we not eat together? We're, we're siblings. <clears throat> Come here. Come here, Chloe. Chloe, oh my gosh, she's not gonna get up, is she? She is not gonna get up off her seat. She is going to sit there and we're gonna have to watch her eat. Chloe, I swear, girl. Okay, let's um make her selectable. I'm gonna cancel out whatever she's doing. And then join my group oh lola's here too that's nice we can ask both sisters hi lola that's sibling behavior <laughs> all right we'll ask we'll ask uh lola to eat with us for fun and then chloe i swear girl if you don't stop eating right now i'm gonna lose my mind please please let me okay what what is happening ask join group there we go. Okay, perfect. I'm gonna make her unselectable now. And Lazo needs to use the restroom like bad. I saw that want. Yeah, I saw that one that Chloe has a has a want to flirt with AJ. I did see that. She's gonna go shop a little bit. <laughs> Vic comes about to die of hunger, and she's just shopping. That's nice. I like to check out the the townies too. Um, this is Jill Smith. Not to be confused with Jenny Smith. We do have a wait isn't there already a jill smith in town hold on it's literally wait i'm confused wait yeah there's two jill smiths in town there's this one and there's little little jill smith 
<clears throat> All right, we're gonna take a seat. Where are we sitting? Hey, Hello. Victims will be about to die of hunger. I'm scared. I'm scared, y'all. It looks like Lola was working out or something. I'm wondering where Chloe went. Oh, Chloe's come back. We're gonna do Chef's Choice. Can't do Chef's Choice for some reason. I think he hasn't gotten a want. Um, or what he's, he hasn't like thought of what he wants yet. There we go, Chef's Choice. Vidkund is so cute. Lola and Chloe are getting along. Don't they normally fight or something? <laughs> I think it's his little stummy. <laughs> his little stummy. He wants cake. Do you guys see that? He wants like chocolate cake or something. That's cute. Oh, there we go. Yes, give me my cake. He's eating a whole slice of it. He's he truly is pregnant. <laughs> He's very pregnant. He's eating this chocolate cake first meal a day, having some chocolate cake. This is a cute little sibling. Cute little sibling outing. I wonder if they're like talking about his alien pregnancy at all. Like, do you think they would talk about it or do you think they're not talking about it? We do surrogate since Pascal and Nervous can't have a baby. I've been thinking about it, yeah. I don't know. I haven't thought that far ahead, but we could. Could. The pregnancy cravings are true. He needs, like, he needs something else, y'all. He, he needs to keep eating. <laughs> Come here. Let me order some more food for me. Uh, order for me. Filet mignon. I need a filet mignon. Pronto. They're probably not surprised. They're giving him tips on how to raise an alien baby. <clears throat> Am I getting my lobster thermidor? Or my filet mignon? Where is it at? Oh, sir, they just hit on, uh, just hit on Chloe. <laughs> She's like, I like red hair, like me. The sisters are so cute, aren't they? I love them. Did I genetically correct some of them? I corrected uh, some of them, but not all of them, no. It's the X. Yeah, that's awkward. That's just a little bit awkward. Where's this chicken at? I love the girls just gossiping. He's not getting his chicken though. I'm not sure why. I ordered a, a fried chicken for him and a filet mignon and I haven't gotten either one. I wonder, oh, the unsavory charlatan's here. Can I like ban the unsavory charlatan? I don't know where I put the adjuster tree. Oh, the witch is here. Oh my gosh, no. I don't want the witch here. I cannot remember for the life of me. Where I'm never gonna find it. This slot is too big. Maybe over here? Yeah, I think we're screwed. I think we just have to, oh, maybe we're here. Yes, oh my gosh, I'm so smart. I should put all of the, all of the spawner tree thingies in one place. We ban, we'll ban the charlatan as well and the witches. Ban them all. Ban head witches. We don't want that. Okay, well, we can't get any more food. I don't know why the game, like, literally won't. It won't, uh. It won't let me <laughs> order more food. Poor Vidkun is still hungry. Oh! It looks like Vidkun's congratulating Chloe on something. I don't know what. Okay. Well, I'm gonna end the casual group. He's like calling all of them over. He's like, bye, my sisters. I'm gonna have him eat some more food, I think. <laughs> I'm gonna have him be seated again. Oh, Lola said that was cool. It's nice to hang out with people who know how to have a good time. Mm. So you can flirt with a townie. All right, we're gonna order some more food. I need to see his turn ons. So his turn ons are um, fatness and great fighter, and he does not like. He does not like unemployed people. Hi, Curious Clockwork. We're playing your family. We are playing your family right now. He ordered cake twice, y'all. Wow. The pregnancy cravings are real today. <laughs> it's so cute how they're gonna be alien aunties for their alien nieces and nephews. I know, right? I should Vidkun and Kristen out. I don't think they had any. They didn't even have it. He had more chemistry with the. 
hostess than I think with Kristen, I think. Where's Kristen? Oh yeah, he has negative chemistry with Kristen. Ordered cake twice, he did. He did order cake twice. It's his favorite food, so he's not he's gonna order it literally forever. Oh man. I should have got him something a little bit more filling because that food was not filling for him. <laughs> his cravings were kicking his ass. <laughs> he really is pregnant, yeah. Oh, okay, so Laszlo's going to work. Uh, I don't know when Pascal is the day off today, I think it said, right? Yeah, it's the day off today. I kind of want him to invite Nervous over, maybe. We can get them maybe moved in together or something. Someone told me to get the mod that allows for adults to go steady. I can't remember if I downloaded it or not. Someone linked me and I really did want it. Because every other Sims game I play has like this. I mean, I guess the only other Sims game I play is Sims 3, but... Adults go steady. I don't think I have the mod. Eh. I gotta grab it. Pascal wants to hire a maid. Oh, that's a good idea. We can do that. They have a lot of money. Did you renovate their house? No, their house is by Fratana. Thoughts on Strange Town so far? Um, I like it, but I like Pleasant View more. That's not to say I don't like Strange Town. I usually change my Sims' favorite food if it's a dessert because I don't remember where you're filling. Yeah. It is. The cake cravings are cute, though. It is. I like that. Because I say the game when Vidkun was returning back, he's like bugged out now. This happens all the time. I forget how I fixed this. It is, I have to force an error on him somehow. I hate when I do this. Why do I do this to myself? First errors on all. Now we just sit here and we hit escape like this. So I can force an error on him. There we go. Okay, he's back. <laughs> I'm holding on the escape key, by the way. Okay, there we go. Yep, he's gonna have to get his bump again. There we go. Okay, and you need to go back to work, sir. If he can. He can't. Oh, he can walk to work. Okay, cool. Walk to work. It's gonna say that he, like, was late or something like that. What the dog doing? Talk to Belly? Oh! That's cute. Wait, let him talk to your belly. Oh, oh, he's like, no, don't talk to my belly, Pascal. Oh, Vidkin does not like the dog. Okay. So now what we're going to do is I'm going to have him invite over Nervous. If he has quads, can we name them after the planet? That's a cool idea. I like that idea. Let's <clears throat> call Nervous over. It's always a pleasure to see you. I'll be right over. Oh, I need to ban dogs off this lot because I cannot stand when they dig holes. Why do you dig holes in my house? I need to add the... Oops. I need to add down visitor controller. What mod lets him walk? I have not a single clue. I'm sorry. I would, I would help you, but I have not a single clue. It's probably on either... Pleasant Sims? No, it's definitely on Pleasant Sims' mod list because that's where I get all my mods. Like, that's where I started. And it gave me, like, a really good basis. Someone will know, though. I feel like someone will know. No quads manifestation, please. Why are critters not... Walk to work isn't a mod. Is it? I have no idea. Why is this dog like not despawning? Oh, okay. Get out of my house. Why are there so many dogs in my house? I, I, I banned dogs. What is happening? Allow dogs. Do I need to ban all critters now? Okay, that's weird. You can just walk if you miss the car. Oh. Okay, cool. Vidcon is taking care of the baby. He needs some he needs some practice. Oh, it looks like Pascal wants to feed um nervous. He wants to give him a good meal. Why can he not use the stove? There we go. I need some apartment light maybe because I think that added walking the lots. Oh, that's cool. Thank you, chat is very helpful actually. <laughs> manifest quads only get issues like pleasant views, so maybe we shouldn't. No manifesting quads. We don't do that. No, 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 no. Vidkun is in such a bad mood. He needs to go right to sleep. This is bad. Yeah, he's about to pass out. 
Wait, he made comfort soup. Oh, he's making a nice, nice soup for her. Nervous, it's cute. Okay, I'm gonna call Nervous to, wait, can I call Nervous to meal? You can't do that. Can you in the Sims 2? I don't think so. I kind of want them to just, yeah, we can propose going steady. <clears throat> oh, you, have, you don't have apartment life. That's okay. Gotcha. Nervous is healthy again. What was nervous is playing chess. How is he healthy again? That's good to know that it comes with apartment life. That is such a handy option. Like I use the walk to work and like walk to lots all the time in this game, like all the time. Okay, Pascal is carpool is coming in an hour. He is exhausted. Let's quickly have him and nervous go steady. Chess is good for the mind and the body. We'll have him go steady and then Pascal has got to go to work. There we go. Perfect. Okay, we can have him leave now. Sorry. I got to kick you out immediately. Adorable. Adorable. Love that. Okay. He's going to go to sleep for like the 30 minutes before he has to go right to work. Okay, Laszlo's home from work. Maybe we should go with Laszlo or something. Laszlo can pick up the phone here. He's probably like, I hope it's for me. We all know it's not going to be for him. Come on. Let's be let's be real here, Laszlo. Wait, was it actually for him? Oh my god, I think it was Crystal. It's Crystal Vu <laughs> calling him up. She, yeah, she just, she's just calling him. I feel like Laszlo's the kind of guy to be like, maybe I still have a chance. <laughs> no, honey. No, you don't. I thought the falling in love was coming from my game. No, it's just nervous and Pascal. Oh, speaking of Pascal, he's late for work. Oopsie. He needed his energy up a little bit. Okay, walk to work. <clears throat> Laszlo creeping on Bella's arrival. Okay, we're gonna have Laszlo go out. Let's just have him go out somewhere. You know, I I need like a bar or something. A bar would be really cool. I think the the swimming pool might have a good bar location. I think Crystal thinks they're best their gay best friends and Laszlo's like one day I'll win the hearts of my lady. Yeah, Laszlo seems like the guy to be like, I still have a chance, so maybe I should just I should accept her calls. Yeah, okay, Laszlo, okay. <clears throat> all the all the brothers want to flirt yeah all right so we're here at the lot he wants to be best friends with crystal now interesting interesting okay i don't know how to feel about that i'm a little weirded out you know i will say a little weirded out by his whole fascination he you know especially coming from laszlo who just gives me the ultimate creepy vibes I should probably also have given him a college degree so he has more wands, but it's, it's fine. Isn't this lot cute? It's from the Sims 2 lot database. So you can just Google it if you want the log. How do you place road template pieces outside of the house limit? Do you have a push button? It's um move objects on, lets you do that. Cersei's here. Hi, Cersei. He has negative chemistry with Cersei. Why is John Burb here? Just kidding. <laughs> he looks like John Burb from far away though. Oh, wow. He is one ugly Sim, I gotta say. Lazo canonically has a college degree, so I feel like giving him one is fine. But yeah, there is, uh, there's a mother that has six wants without going to uni. I like the idea of going to uni because it kind of entices me to unlock those wands <clears throat> why is Laszlo at the pool you know he's just on the prowl oh Cameron Lee this is a sim that I had one of the broke brothers get with I think it was a broke brother in college she's cute and she has black hair and Laszlo likes black hair Let's see if they have any chemistry chemistry oh he has two bolts with her perfect Okay, it's townie time. I'm getting with the townie. Oh, he likes her. Let's ask her if she likes what she sees. Now he wants to talk to her. <gasps> and we got rid of the crystal vu want, so that's nice. Let's just have him chat. Oh, he like, she likes jewelry or accessories, I guess. Cameron Lee's really cute. 
Okay. Let's just chat, chat with her a little bit. John Burb, if John Burb was mauled by a bear. Imagine if Lazlo tries to flirt with Cersei and that'd be bad. That would be bad. Kristen's here. Is he like Kristen? I don't think he likes Kristen. I think we already checked, right? Oh, he hasn't met her yet. Okay, let's let's greet Kristen. I would prefer to keep them, the relationships with like pre-mates, but if they end up with townies, I don't mind either. A lot of people are like pre-made only supremacy, but I, I don't I don't really care, honestly. Kristen is like trying to greet Lazo like no other. All right, you two can stop talking. Let's see. Let's check her out. Let's see if he has any chemistry with her. Oh, he likes Tristan. How many bolts? Oh, I, I went too quickly through the menu here. Oh, they're not getting along already. Oh, no. Y'all, please stop. How many bolts do you two have? I just skipped it. What am I doing? Oh, no, he has negative chemistry. What are you saying? I think Lazo's just so desperate for some loving <laughs> that he's... Even though he has no chemistry with Kristen, he's like he's like willing to settle for her. He just wants some love in his life. Listen, this guy is desperate. As someone said earlier, he's an incel. You know, apparently the chef got their uh, his gender preference rolled. Good to know. <laughs> I'm dangerously close to redeeming risky with Maddie. Watch out. I never use the matchmaker. No. I don't know, it's, it's it's like one of those aspects of The Sims that I I kind of like the idea of like hunting down my my Sims is romantic. Oh, Kristen does. <gasps> Ooh, that is tough. Okay, Kristen did not like the wolf whistle. She was not into that. Let's see if she likes Laszlo at all. She's like, no. Oh, Cersei's hitting on Kristen. Cersei was also hitting on Chloe. So I think Cersei's attracted to all these beautiful women in this town oh get away from her get away from her she's gonna get you sick <laughs> run away laszlo run all right we're gonna send laszlo home this was a fail i guess he did meet he's looking at me like maddie don't you say it was a fail he met cameron lee which is a good option cameron's really pretty and i like her so say is bi yes she is oh jenny's here jenny's like all she loves just walking around she's everywhere <laughs> laszlo you are a creep <laughs> I can't believe that he initially he was like, what did he try to do? Didn't he try to like flirt with Kirsten or something? And then I look and he has negative chemistry with her like Lazlo, dude. He, Lazlo is just desperate. He just wants anybody at this point. He will take anybody. I'm going to Fratana's Tumblr and downloading all the house makeovers. Definitely not doing that. They're so pretty. They are so gorgeous. Yeah, I don't trust the match. I just want to sim Kuna for my hood. We'll see. I can use it. I'm not sure how the matchmaker... Does it just pull any sim from the neighborhood? Or does it spawn a sim? Like, does it generate a sim? I don't know. I've never used the matchmaker before. We could if we're that desperate. We could. <clears throat> I'm still worried about Vidkun. Like, Vidkun needs a partner. He needs somebody. Matchmaker, I feel like it would be coolest. We could use it with Laszlo, especially because he's so damn desperate. Like, he's wanting to flirt with Kristen, which is so weird. He has no bolts with her and he wants her still. I never had that happen before. Well, I mean, it's ex it's it's expected with Laszlo, considering his weirdo track record. He's just desperate, man. I feel bad for me because Laszlo is usually the cutest. They generate sims i'm pretty sure i have a better look i do have custom face templates that's what i was wondering i was gonna my follow-up question was gonna be do they use the custom face templates if you have them it pulls from townies and playables generates not spawns okay pascal's home <gasps> pascal wants to get engaged to nervous okay i'm gonna get their college degrees up i feel like all three brothers would have college degrees like i feel like that's just it just makes sense. So I'm going to give them. I mean, it says that Laszlo has a degree in psychology, wasn't it? So we'll give him psych and then we can give Pascal a degree in science or there's no science, biology or physics, I guess physics. And we'll give one to Bitcoin as well. There we go. Yes, a wedding. 
Pascal wants to get engaged. <clears throat> Let's call it polls from townies and playables. That's actually really good. How do you do it? How do you use the matchmaker? You call it on the phone, right? Baby's orange, I know. We gotta go take care of her. Um, I'm ready for her to age up at this point. <laughs> I'm ready for her to age up. All right, we're gonna have Laszlo get on the phone here. He's had no luck in love. He needs some loving. So we'll do the matchmaking service. Let's see what he gets. I can sense you are looking for someone to spend the rest of your days with. Do you require my matchmaking services? Yes, I do. I really do. The baby is high maintenance. I've never seen like a baby like this. I've never seen a baby like this. All right, I'm ready. Give me a good sim. Come on. Come on. Give me someone good. Are we going to get a gender vote this time? Oh, like a prediction for Vidkin's baby. He is so far off, I think. Because when I reset or when I had to, uh, had to... Yeah, to reset him because he got stuck because I saved the game and left it when he was using community time. So his pregnancy, I'm pretty sure, got reset, which I'm very sad about. 10K? What? Is it 10K? For a... Are you serious? For a matchmaker? Where, where's a matchmaker? She's like not here. <laughs> Where'd she go? I was like waiting outside for her. I guess she maybe she doesn't come at nighttime? Oh, shoot. I do have the matchmaker band. You are correct. Thank you. I would have never put that together. Thank you. Thank you. I think it's... Do they call... I think that I think that's what she's called in this game. I can... Yeah, I could accelerate his, his pregnancy. Let's have... It can have some spaghetti. I guess the matchmaker does pull from playables too because Wiki says in Pleasant View, if she is paid 5,000 millions, there's a chance a Bella Goff will appear. Oh, I should check... Uh, I can check pregnancy scanner. I don't want it to reveal the sex of the baby yet because we could do like a little prediction so 32 hours so he just the game just literally got him pregnant when i had to reset him which is sad but i do think that he will have the baby yeah he will he'll have the, he'll have the baby in this rotation anyway so it doesn't matter we can do a we can do a gender uh prediction now let me do start prediction start prediction here we can do will the baby be a boy or a girl i'll do it for like 15 minutes because i'm not gonna speed up his pregnancy at all because i don't care if he you know it doesn't matter how long it takes him to get pregnant or not because it's not like he can have another one unless he like looks at the telescope again okay so there's your prediction you guys can vote like in chat now if you want to get some cotton socks I'm hoping it's a girl. Let me see what the prediction is. So most of you think it's girl right now. Girl is winning by a long shot. I have ultimate collection. And for some reason, when I go to install Sims 2 packs, it tells me that EP data I don't have. Do you have OSAB's installer? Because that's a lot easier to use than games, uh, old games download. Osabs is just like an all-in-one thing. I do not. Yeah, I would use Osabs. Here, I'll put it in chat. Osabs installer. Just Google that and then you can find the link. I also have like a whole tutorial if you need a guide to follow. I have a whole tutorial on my Tumblr. Um, Tumblr, Sims 2 Tumblr. You can, it's like linked on my Tumblr. It's a, If you click that link, it's the first post on the top. I feel like this sounds gonna have the opposite gender problem as Pleasant View. Yeah, Pleasant View is plagued with boys. It's like disproportionately boys, which is concerning. I'm going to call the matchmaker again for Laszlo because I had her banned before. So let me, I unbanned her. All right, so we'll call matchmaking service. Yes, she's gonna be right over. Hopefully this time she'll actually show up. This house is like so dirty. <clears throat> Vidkin's cleaning up for everybody. Thank you, Vidkin. I'm gonna send him right to bed too. Oh, she's here, she's here, she's here, she's here. What's her name? Tasha. 
Pasha Buckingham's here. <laughs> like of the palace party. All right, let's go and greet her. If it couldn't has a boy, we can yeah, we can name him Tycho. Yeah. All right, we're gonna ask for a blind date. I'm scared. I'm so scared. I've never used a matchmaker. Laszlo's desperate, y'all. Uh, I would like my date to be female. Ooh. Ooh, 5K. Okay. Ooh, only your cash can help my crystal bowl pierce the mist of fate that veil the inner nature of your perfect match. If you let your stinginess cloud my vision, you'll only have yourself to blame. Now then, how much? I guess he'll pay. I feel like he would pay any amount. I feel like Laszlo gives me vibes of being on every single dating site known to man. He's on Tinder. He's on Plenty of Fish. He's on alien matchmaking. I don't know. Okay, we're going to do 5K. She's like, thank you for your money. Oh my gosh. Who will he get? I'm scared. What if it's a what if it's a pre-made? I'm gonna scream if it's a pre-made. <gasps> Look, really? It's a chef? Really? It's a chef? Really? Come on, game. I was hoping. Okay, she's a family sim. Alright, she's a family sim. <laughs> Charlene Royce. Really? Oh, it's it's Astra's birthday too. In the middle of the date. They only have let me see how many. Oh, they have three bolts. No, they have they have two bolts! The game gave me a date with a two bolt sim, really? Okay. Well. Also, she's trying to like age up Astra. I really wanted it to be a pre-made. Yeah, at least she can cook, right? <laughs> The, yeah, Lazo has high cooking skill. Wait, does he actually? Oh, he does. He has super high cooking skill. So that, that's something that they have in common, right? Okay, it's Astra's birthday. I'm trying to like age her up. <laughs> I was hoping for a pre-made to be honest. All right, let's age up Astra here. I don't know why she's not aging him. Yeah, he must not have much chemistry with the pre-mates. That's true. I guess he doesn't. I'm sad about that. Wait, why are you putting her back down? What is happening? She's like trying to age up. Oh, okay. she's trying to age up the baby. All right, let's put Astra down here. Oh no! Look at her nose, y'all. Oh dear. Oh dear. <laughs> she's so scary. <gasps> she's so scary. Okay, we might need to reroll her face because this is before I got the default replacement. Oh yikes! I am very saddened. Yeah, her cheekbones. Astra needs a reroll. It is true. She does. Poor baby. <laughs> Plastic surgery for 18th birthday. Oof. Yeah, that's tough. Okay, so let's have Lazlo go on his little date. I'm a little disappointed he didn't get not he did not get paired with a pre-made or a townie. It's just like a randomly generated service sim. <laughs> he wants to dine out with her. I love that she showed up in her chef outfit. <laughs> funny well at least they want to become friends right i can't believe it gave him a two bolt sim though like i would expect it to at least give a three bolt sim time is running out already yeah this date is not going very well is it yeah mm. save game okay i'll save yeah that was not i did not yeah astra looks very unfortunate aged up i will say <laughs> I also want to change. Oh, I just I didn't mean to spawn the trash can. What, what did I just do? I need to delete the remover. OK, um, let's go see her up. Lazo needs a beard, a neck beard, <laughs> a neck beard. <laughs> oh, wow. 17K points are in boy right now for the prediction for Vidkin's baby. That's crazy. All right, we're going to give her something like this. She needs like a new face. I'm gonna give her eyelashes too. Let's just see how that looks on her big old alien eyes. She looks like a true, she does look like a true alien. She will probably be, ooh, with her teeth out, it looks even weirder. Mm -mm. They failed, no chef for him. Yeah, that was just not, that, I'm a little disappointed with who the matchmaker spawned, honestly. She could grow in her eyes, yeah. Laura, thank you for four months of Prime. I appreciate it. I appreciate it. 
Not, the, the matchmaker did us did not do us uh very well with the state i gotta say okay now we have two more minutes well at least you know they got something in common she definitely looks like a service sim though like she has the template kind of the the template townie face oh there is a risky woohoo all right i guess we're risky woohooing with these two is that who y'all want is that who we're doing I can't even have them woohoo yet. Are we doing this? What have I missed since last stream? Uh, quite a bit, quite a bit. We're on a date right now. They're just dancing in the living room. She's pretty though. Uh, greetings to you, my dearie. I've heard this town has Sims looking for a perfect mate and I've come to help. Oh, well, this did not help me, Miss Smashmaker. You did not help me very well with this date. <clears throat> That's uh I can't have them they have to kiss first, so we'll have Laszlo try and kiss her. Let's see if it goes through. Alright, Laszlo, come on. Don't fail this one. Oh, it went through, I think. I think it went through. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> nothing to see here you're just kissing in the living room all right so they have a crush on each other now and then we'll have them go ahead and woohoo in the bed i think she will be cute with a makeover oh wow her long hair just came out of her her chef hat okay that was interesting all right we're gonna let them woohoo and uh, we're gonna look at this nice this nice little plant over here. All right, casual woohoo. So we're gonna do a roll in chat, ten or below. Okay, she rolled fifty-seven, so nothing happens. But she had her bun up for food safety. Exactly, y'all. Exactly. Oh, poor. Why does Pascal like not take care of his daughter? <laughs> That's what I want to know. Like, why, Pascal? He doesn't like autonomously take care of her. She's gonna be selectable. Well, what I do is I do a, I just do like a one through, one through, uh, one through 100. And if it's 10 or below, I just get her pregnant that way. It works the same way. Her outfit definitely does her dirty for sure. Pascal's like fast asleep. He's like, I gotta go. Well, at least, you know, Pascal got a woohoo of some variety, you know? At least that happens. He's not forever alone. He had, it's like a Tinder hookup, you know? That's like how this basically functioned. Is the relationship OSHA compliant? <laughs> Perhaps. Get a back row from Laszlo, we can do that. She's new to the town, doesn't know how he uses his telescope. Yeah, he looks at people, peeks at people through his telescope, but she doesn't know that yet, so it's okay. Oh, someone's on a telescope up here. Oh, it's Pascal. I love that he just does, he's just not taking care. Oh, oh, he put her in there. Okay, good job, Pascal. Oh, well, he didn't. Meanwhile, Vidkun is like constantly hungry. I'm gonna have him have some ramen. I know you're hungry, boy. I know, I'm working on it. Okay, so their date's over. That was like the longest date I think I've ever seen. <laughs> it was such a long time. Is the maid pretty? Yes, the maid is actually really pretty. Surprisingly, I think she's like, isn't she always the same maid in this town? Let's see. Here she is. She's really pretty, actually. She's cute. When I dump the Sims, do I put them through clean installer or another way? I think you can put them in clean installer, I believe. Could be wrong about that. Someone in chat can, won't let you know. Good thing she has her non-slips on. <laughs> Let me move this because they can't use the shower in here. I need to like move this towel rack. Uh, right there. <clears throat> I don't know if we'll have them have a second date. I'll have to see. But oh, what we, can, what we could do is so Pascal doesn't work till. 4 p.m. We could have him and Nervous go on a date because he wants to get engaged to Nervous and I really want to do something like big with this family because we haven't really done much with them. I mean, I guess Astra aged up or whatever, but that's fine. So we'll have them go out to a community lot 
and I'm gonna have him get engaged. It's gonna be super quick because he leaves for work at 4 p.m. So we have to do all this, have him get engaged, have him go on a date, whatever, before 4 p.m. So Vidkun and Laszlo can watch Astra for the day. She's fast asleep anyway, so it doesn't matter. Paz, Paz Voos time, <laughs> Paz Vu time. The chef left, she's not here anymore. All right, they're gonna go on like a nice little date. <clears throat> Clean installer does work for Sims. Okay, that's good to know. It's good to know, actually. It should come as a dot Sims pack. I don't know if I ever installed Sims with clean installer. I know lots for sure. That's mainly what I use it for is just lots. I'm glad I get to play with like the curious family, just like the whole thing. How many days do they have left? It feels like I've been playing them four days. Okay. All right, so Pascal's here with Nervous. We've come to do one thing here, Nervous. We're gonna go on like a nice little restaurant date. We gotta move quick, y'all. It is already 1.30. He lives for work at four. This is gonna be quite a quick engagement here. We could actually, there is a special interaction if you have dine out. Oh, what's that game called? Open for business? Is that out of like the restaurant stuff? I think so, right? Dine out with Sims 4, what am I saying? There's a cute little engagement that we can do like at the dinner table. It is so adorable. Maybe it was nightlife that added it. Okay, I don't know. I don't know like what came in what Sims pack. I'm I'm just I'm a mess when it comes to that stuff. Nightlife. Okay, good nightlife. Are right, we gonna have them toast? Look, he even wants to get engaged to Pascal. How cute! All right, him and his crimson crimson chin. We gotta quickly do this. So I'm gonna queue up and toast and an engagement. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. <gasps> He's like, oh wait, I can't get it. Oh my gosh, the wall is blocking me. Y'all, we almost just missed that cute little engagement. He's pulling out the ring. Why is this waitress like in my business? <laughs> She's like in my business. <gasps> Nervous is like, oh my gosh. He's picking up the ring. Oh, how cute. Wait, why is this? Pascal looks like shook. He's like confused. Oh, he says yes, of course. How cute. He grabs his hand. Oh, adorable. They're engaged. I thought that had to happen so fast, but I've got work later. I gotta make us an income. And of course, now he wants to get married. Wait, I locked in the wish for him to get engaged and it like didn't complete it. That's weird. I can click any other one, but besides that one, that's weird. <laughs> These boys need some body hair. I keep forgetting to give it to like all these sims. Are we not gonna get food or what's going on? All right, let's order. Let's order, wait, I can't do chef's choice. There we go, all right. We have like an hour left and we gotta get home. So Pascal can go to work. Hopefully we can eat that quick. PT9's here. Why is PT9 here? Hello? He's like looking like, really? <laughs> PG9 is trying to greet us. He's like, you're the one that had the alien baby. Oh, Lola's here too. Or Chloe, sorry, I keep getting them confused. Chloe's here. She just checked out somebody. I think it was Nervous, maybe. Oh, Nervous is just going to town, man. We got an engagement. We have like 20 minutes left with them. We gotta go. I wish they would talk less and eat more. I know there's a mod. I think I have the mod that makes them eat more and talk less, but... All right, we gotta go. I'm so sorry. We gotta go, Nervous. I have work, like, right now, so... I'm gonna end our... Who's peeing so loudly? Loki, of course. Loki's here to ruin the moment. All right, we're gonna end the dates. We're gonna pay the bill, and we gotta dip. I'm sorry. Oh, no, I think I have to call a taxi, because he took a taxi here, so now he's gotta take a taxi back. Loki's being hateful. He's he's keeping an eye on Nervous. He's like scoping the situation out. He's gonna go back home to Cersei and report. I feel like Loki would really hate Pascal because he's like trying to take their, you know, their subject that they do their experiments on. He's trying to take him away. Yeah, he does want to throw a wedding party. All right, we gotta go home. He's gonna be like an hour late to work. This is so sad. <laughs> this is really sad. I think, I think it was Lazel that was late. I don't think it was Pascal, so. Look, he's always spying. All right, we're gonna go home now. 
he's gonna be super late for work, but that's okay. At least he got engaged. Loki and Laszlo, the two creeps. Yeah. I, it's very unfortunate how Laszlo turned out, like, weird and all that. Do you have multiple PT9s in your game? We have PT or PTs. We have PT, the one, the NPC, and then we have PT9, the pre made, Pleasant View, uh, <laughs> Pleasant View, Strange Town pre made. I keep saying Pleasant View because it's just like my reaction to say Pleasant View. All right, Vidcon, go into the phone. <clears throat> Is Pascal available? Isn't this the hostess? She wants she wants to wish us congratulations for getting engaged. Pleasant View's not on a hiatus. No, we're gonna be playing it next week. I'm doing two weeks of oh the maid's still here. Wait, someone asked and she literally was still here. She's taking care of the of the baby. Why is she still in my house? Why are you still here, ma'am? What? She's cooking. Oh no, she's getting a bottle. I literally did not think she was still here, but she is. Anyway, I was going to say that we, we're doing two weeks of Strange Town and then one week of Pleasant View. That's how we're going to do this. We do need smart milk because there's going to be Ew. a lot of babies. Oh, Sammy redeemed a fix, an in-game sim. Who would you like me to fix, Sammy? <clears throat> At least she's helpful. She is. Yeah, she is. She's a family sim and she knows she's never going to have a family room. Bye, acid. Give the chef a chef's kiss makeover? Where's she at? She left already. I asked her to leave. I wish I would have seen that. What was her name? Charlene or something? Uh, where would she be? Under NPC? I don't know. What was her last name? I don't even remember. It was Charlene. Charlene something. Where, oh my gosh, there's so many. There's just so many Sims in here. Charlene, Charlene, where are you? Charlene Royce, here she is. All right, we're, we'll change her. We'll give her a little makeover because you want to. <clears throat> and long hair? I can give her some long hair. Um, She had like that long straight hair in her, what's it called? Sleepwear, so we'll give her that. See, this one's cute. This is the one I gave to Jenny. I think this is the one she added in her sleepwear. So we'll give her this because she already had that. And then we'll give her like mascara and maybe like a lip, nice lipstick. Let's do maybe, this looks good on her. And then I gotta change her clothes too. So she has uh, the chef outfit. She's pretty, yeah, she's pretty. Maybe this color, I don't know, I'm just, I'm trying not to give these sims when I give them these makeovers. Try not to give them like long pants because this is like a desert, so it's gonna be really warm all the time. I don't want Laszlo and her to end it together. I never ship random town. I don't either. The townies always just kind of like fall into place for me. Hey, at least we know though that she has chemistry with him because this is kind of like a like a mom outfit that I gave her. Oops, I did not mean to give her a mom outfit, but there we go. Okay, so there is Charlene's makeover. I think I want to play Sims 2 since I can't play Sims 3. Yeah, the, the weird skin and skin glitch and in, in gussy up is really, I don't know why it does that, but. Okay, Lazlo's up now. He still wants to be BFFs with Crystal. Actually, we need to take care of Astra because she's just like, She's going through it. All right, we're gonna go in potty train Astra. Buzzview, did you do the scripted events on stream? No, I think I did them in my own time. Oh, she didn't even go. Why? Why didn't you go? Astra. Sometimes my sims just like immediately get up. I don't know why they do that. There we go. Pascal, currently, if he, if we were playing him, he would be getting engaged right now. Just like trying to work out the community time. There we go. Okay, there we go. So we're gonna empty this. I'm gonna put Astra back in her crib because she's kind of tired. And then Pascal, as soon as he gets home, don't even don't even come home. Don't even step out of the taxi. You have to go to work. There we go. 
straight to work. Laszlo's bed sheets. They're very distracting. Zodiac? What Zodiac is Astro? Oh. <laughs> okay. That was not what I was expecting. Alright, they're just macking on each other. Um Astra not in the baby nursery. Y'all, come on, get out of there. I told you wait, I thought Oh, they're making out. I thought they're gonna woo. Let's not do that in the baby nursery, please. <laughs> Alright, let's uh so Astra's Libra, which means in my game she would be What is a Libra? I have to check my put I don't have like the list up. So if she's a Libra, she is going to be a romance sim. That is a romance sim. Sorry, I'm like taking the whole zodiac sign thingy and dragging it over. There we go. Okay. She's trying to, she's trying to become a mother to match her mom outfit. What are these two doing? Are they doing what I think they're gonna be doing? Leaping arms. Oh, cute. Okay, so I'm gonna have him go and serve some turkey. Astra and Chloe can be two alien robins baddies. <clears throat> Hopefully, um, a little sterile as a romance sim because her alien face. I actually kind of like that she has like a true alien face because we will never have that again because I downloaded a default replacement PT. So yeah, we'll never have like a true alien face like that ever again in our game, sadly. She will be the last of a line. Maybe it's, maybe it's kind of nice that we're keeping her alien face. You know what I'm saying? I was gonna regenerate it or re-roll it, but I don't actually think I need to because we're gonna keep her super alien looking face. She's like crying. Okay, <laughs> Charlene keeps trying to take care of her. Charlene, I appreciate it, but like move, please <laughs> get out of my way. Yes, I did change the lizard eyes for the aliens. Yeah, this TV is so loud. <laughs> Our cute little bug eyed Astra, true. The lizard eyes were very scary. I don't know why they look like that. Well, I mean, that's how the creator made them. That's why they look like that. But they were a little bit spooky. Gave them gave a little spooky look to the aliens for sure. But couldn't she have his baby within the cu couple next hours? Let me... Why did I say it like that? Next couple hours, not couple next hours. <laughs> uh, pregnancy scanner, he is... Oh. Is his bump stuck? He's been 32 hours pregnant for like... A while. Hmm. I think his bump may be stuck. When I reset him, maybe his bump got stuck? I don't know what, I don't, I'm scared now. Oh, did it get paused? How would I, how would I check if his bump got, I guess we could go to Sim Blender, right? Go to pregnancy. It can, uh, oh yep, it got paused. Okay, so we're gonna accelerate his pregnancy because he technically should only be I mean, this is gonna accelerate it, so it's super fast now. Yeah, I'm gonna accelerate it because we did lose a whole day. I can't believe it paused it though. It's so I've never had that happen before. Hmm. I'm gonna say bye to Charlene because she's just like sitting around doing nothing really. Laszlo, what a good uncle. Teaching her how to walk. Oh, my mouse is frozen. It's weird. I'm gonna save the game, but my mouse like froze when I did that. Who's that girl in the house? That is Laszlo's love interest, Charlene, our matchmaker, our matchmaker, um, our matchmaker love interest, I guess. Yeah, I accelerated it, so he should be having the baby like super fast now. I don't know how fast it accelerates it too, but it's faster. Maybe an alien pregnancy works differently. Oh, did she learn how to walk? I think she did learn how to walk. Oh no, not yet. Lazo like went to go and take like a bath. So we're gonna wake Pascal up to take care of her. All right, sleep time and take care of her. And then we're gonna feed her a bottle. Oh no, never mind. She's like so tired. She needs to just sleep. Okay, Lazo's playing in the tub. Nice. 
he should have had it by now yeah but it'll go quicker now that i accelerated the pregnancy it won't be as as long wait is, do i click resume oh shoot oh there we go <laughs> there's this bump i had to click resume on it oops my bad i did not hit resume oh there we go there we go y'all it's time it's time for the laszlo baby not laszlo vicken i meant vicken here we go here we go here we go here we go we're gonna click random i think it's just one baby yes thank god it's just one baby oh my gosh Oh, <laughs> the door. <laughs> the door kind of give it up. Oh, it's a boy. Okay, Tycho. Immediately, Tycho. Tycho, curious. Here he is. Yay. Congrats, Bidcoon. Yay. And they just threw him on the, on the floor. Okay, so I'm going to give you guys your points. Congrats for those of you that voted boy. We're gonna choose a boy there we go congrats guys and we're gonna give a nice room makeover to Tycho. so this room i think was made when Tycho is supposed to be older and yeah because it's just messed up but it's fine we can just throw a crib in here and this will be his room and he ages up to a child so those are the boat there are those are the two curious babies i guess we'll have to see when the what is this i'm a little teapot oh okay i hate the english text sometimes i really do in this game <laughs> i'm a bad loser it's rigged <laughs> i want like a nice like alien a little alien i really want to see what he looks like when he ages up because he already looks he's cute he's got like really blue eyes i feel like he'll be really handsome because vidkin's handsome so and my new pt9 or my pt replacement is handsome too i'm gonna save the game and then what we're gonna do is I'm gonna age him up to an adult. And then I'm just gonna save up without quitting so that we can play through his like life. Where'd you get Kirby colors? I think at the room all the Sims actually. Tycho's made his de debut, he did. So we're gonna go aging, age to adult. I think I think I have to age Tycho. Oh, age, age up baby Tycho, there we go. Oh, do you wanna age up Astro too? Yeah, we can age up both. So we'll go aging, age to adult, Astra. It's not gonna work. Hello? Game? Do you wanna work? It's not aging there. Um, age up Tycho, please. Okay, so there's Tycho. I'm gonna age him up to a adult now. Okay, there we go. Oh my gosh, I don't know why he has dreadlocks <laughs> that's not your hair texture <laughs> okay we'll just give him this and oh oh he's got like super small eyes <laughs> um hmm i thought he was gonna be more handsome to be honest but that's okay all right let's grab this baby up here he's he looks sad he does look sad okay put astra there he looks normal. <laughs> he looks normal. Okay. Oh, she aged up. Oh my gosh. She like immediately aged up. Okay. So here's, here's Astra and she looks so alien. Like so, so, so alien. Look at her. She has got the biggest alien eyes I think I've ever seen. <laughs> her nose is so tiny. She will be the last alien that looks like a straight up alien. <laughs> That's interesting. Yeah. Ah, tragic. She's cute. She's giving bug life. I think that... I think that Tycho looks more cute than him. Uh, her, I mean. Yeah. Okay, let me load out of this family. Do I want to save? No, I don't. We can... Now we can play through them now that we look like... We know that what they're going to look like when they age up. 
I should also add them to our spreadsheets. Isn't it weird that some speak Simlish, but there's no Simlish names, like every language have their own names. I feel like my my rationale for that is like, we play the game translated into our language, if that makes sense. That's why we play like with uh, English names, I guess. Okay, Astra and we have Tycho. I don't know why I can think of his name, Tycho. He's a baby and we're gonna change Astra to toddler. And there we go on the spreadsheet. Oh yes official they're spreadsheet official guys there's like this color i'm gonna just grab that color oh shoot i clicked the wrong one perfect okay Tycho looks like one of soundcloud rappers from my high school <laughs> they're spreadsheet official guys does the clean template of pleasant view fix cassandra's genetics no you would have to download the genetically correct pleasant view which fixes the it has clean tempo already in it and it fixes all their genetics. <clears throat> Tycho growing up from a baby to an adult was such a Sims 4 throwback. I actually have yet to have a Sim Let's miscarry <laughs> after they give birth. I haven't had it yet. I'm scared to have it happen, to be honest. I am. Well, it's a little bit different because in this in this strange town, Tycho is actually the child of Vidcon instead of being the child of Pascal, but that's okay. All right, so it's time for someone to go to work. Is it Laszlo? Yes, also Laszlo's like fast asleep. Okay, Astra, she needs a bottle. I'm gonna actually give her a smart milk and he can make it because he has gold aspiration. And maybe we can teach her something. Give me a phone call. Lazo wanted to get abducted. Oh, he did, didn't he? Did I not see it? Or did you not have a wish? Vidkun, is Lazo available to talk? She's like, so about that matchmaking I did with you. Um, yeah. It was quite upsetting to have us in this carry. I just, I kind of just want to see it. You know what I mean? I kind of just want to like see what it's like. Right, let's teach Astra her skills. It looks like Vidkun wants to become friends with Kristen and Aaron. So he, we're going to need to have him hang out with the singles household, I think. My Sims miscarry all the time. I mean, I didn't mean not. Uh, did I say miscarry? I meant the the uh, childbirth. That's what I meant. Not the miscarry. I've had Sims miscarry too. <clears throat> Oh, what was that? Your green energy has been exceeded your energy consumption. Oh, we got money because we have solar panels. That's sick. That is sick. I think I might call Aaron over and Kristen. Maybe both. Let's call Aaron. Where's she at? Aaron, invite over. Aaron is so cute. And then we're gonna invite Kristen over too because <laughs> he wants to become friendly with both. Maybe in here, one of these sisters will, just, I just said sisters, like they're Lola and Chloe. Oh my gosh. I meant one of the ones in the household, not sisters, they're not sisters. Let me make that clear. Where are they at? Okay, so they came from opposite sides of the, oh, that's Jenny. That's not, that's not Kristen. Let's see if they have any chemistry. What are his turn-ons? Let's see, he likes, Fatness and Great Fighter. None of these girls are that. So I don't think he's going to have it. We'll see if he has. Yeah, he has no chemistry with Aaron and Kristen. He has one bowl with. Kind of disappointing. Yeah, I'm thinking about re-rolling his turn-ons. The gender of the baby was a boy. I'm thinking about re -rolling. Let's Let's change his turn-ons because I'm just not... I'm not vibing with his turn-ons, so let's change his turn-ons. I'm gonna roll one through four as well so that we can get a hair color. So number, I'm gonna look up number generator. Oh, Kristen's athletic, so she might be a good fighter. Okay, I got number two. I'm gonna change this one and change it to, ooh, he likes redheads. Cersei? Cersei? Cersei, y'all? It tracks, hey, it tracks. He likes redheads. It tracks. Come on. He was literally, he was literally with Cersei before, so it makes sense. I'm gonna have Pascal take care of Psycho. 
One, bo one bolt with Kirsten. Did that, did that change anything? Bye, Belgoff fan page. Yeah, that did not change anything with Aaron or Kirsten. Yeah, he has one bolt with Kirsten, which is like eh, kind of disappointing. I'm going to make sure that they become friends, though, because that's what he wants to do. So, just Wait, did Kirsten leave? I'm going to sell this flower, too. Um, did Kirsten leave? Yeah, I think she just left because he's just chatting with Aaron. That'd be so funny if he gets with Aaron, Aaron just to make Loki mad. I don't think he will, though, because he does not like her. Oh, he wants to appreciate her now. Okay. Some of the Lafayette Tech girls are redheads. Yeah, I'll have to add Lafayette Tech. I think that's the only neighborhood I'm going to add. Just because I feel like Strange Town wouldn't have a lot of neighborhoods, you know? It doesn't make sense. It's a small town. All right, Pascal's carpool arrives in an hour. I'm going to have him go and grab some to eat. If it comes Purple, he needs to sleep before he goes to work. Oh my gosh, his energy is so low. You can usually ask chemistry with Crystal Vu in my game, but that's that is so messy. Oh my gosh. Yeah, she rolled as gay here. <clears throat> one of the sorority girls in Lafayette Tech looks like Barb from Stranger Things. I think I know the one you're talking about. The one with the glasses. Lilith used to live with them. Yeah, I know what you're talking about. <laughs> All right, carpools are here. Let's get everyone up. Lazo wants to bring home Loki Beaker from work today. I kind of want it for the drama, so yes, I will. I feel like Lazo is going to roll up and be like, Aaron, why are you here? Why are you associating with them? <laughs> I love that. That is so drama. Wow. Laszlo liking Loki? What is this? That's that's unusual. It's it's strange. It's very strange. Drama. Hi Veronica. The drama of it all. Enemies to lovers, true. Loki was sick apparently. Aaron's just going upstairs using the bathroom. Aaron Beaker's no longer a friend. Why? We just became friends with her. The king is going to be like, Lasso, why did you have to bring him home? They're literally besties. It's so weird. What's going on up here? Oh, Astra's just playing in the toilet, I think. Yep. Oh, she's so tired. She's passing out. Lasso, go take care of your niece. Lasso's real desperate. Yes, he is real desperate. Um... He will take anything. He will he will date anyone. He has no criteria at this point. He just wants something living, breathing, and with a pulse. Hi Mal. Mal my husband's here, everybody. <laughs> in his in his sock puppet is a wig. How cute is the the sock puppet with the wig? How cute is that? He's got the little wig on his sock puppet. For those of you guys that don't know or can't see, here's what it looks like. Like, how cute is this? Look at the little sock puppet with the wig. I love it. Adorable. Absolutely adorable. Yeah, the baby was sleeping on the bathroom floor. Kind of gross, right? It's giving Hannah Montana. <laughs> hey, get up, get loud. It's pumping up the party now. Hi, Pixie Stick. They're just having a ball over here. I think before I play with Loki and Cersei, I need to default replace his face because that, that brow bone, I know the default replacement that I saw online has him having a less intense brow bone. Malika has double life as a Twitch mod and whatever his day job is, I forgot. An electrician. Or an apprentice to an electrician, but an electrician. Except he didn't work today, so he was just like playing video games, basically. <laughs> Electrical assistant, yes, that is it. That is what he does. Someday he'll be an electrician, but right now he's apprentice. All right, put Astra in there. It's bedtime. We're actually playing through them quite quickly. Oh, there's a toy in the way, so I can't put her in there. 
All these, all the Curious Brothers are so nice. They're so sweet. Oh, except Lazlo. He's kind of giving me weird vibes, but that's okay. Okay, maybe Lazlo will like Aaron. I don't know. I'm just throwing stuff at the wall at this point. Let's see. Any bolts with her? Any bolts with her at all? Let's check her out. I don't think so. Wait, where's she at? Oh, one bolt. Okay, one bolt. I feel like Loki would like Lazlo with her more than like Vidgun. La Lazlo can stargaze. Yeah, we can have Lazlo stargaze. Actually, I don't know if I want Lazlo to have an alien pregnancy, but we'll see if that happens. We'll see. Erin does seem sweet. I like her a lot. She's cute. And look, he wants to talk to her now. All right, let's let's grab Tycho. Grab your baby. Go change his diaper. He's like going. He came right home and went to sleep. I love that. Oh, oh, Pascal. I did not even hear them fighting down here. <laughs> okay, we need to ask Loki to leave. Get out, Loki. Tycho's birthday is only a day away and Astro's birthday is only a day away. So we're on perfect schedule because look at guys, when there's little to no Sims in this household, look how good I can take care of all the babies and stuff. Like Astro already owes all her skill. What? Why did you just throw your baby on the, oh, Aaron is stinky. Aaron's a stinky girl. Aaron looks like, I know that she looks like she stinks, but, um, well, right now she actually does stink, but you know. Oh, she had to pick him up? Oh no. I thought she was gonna pick up the alien baby. Wait, no, 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 good. Why are you putting her there? Why, why are you doing this? Put this there. Put this, put this there. <laughs> Okay, uh, Astra. No, we don't want Astra in there. We want Tycho in there. Is, oh, I thought Aaron was like going into Pascal's bedroom. I was so confused. 10 years later, Malachi. Seriously, you're spawning like 10 years late. <laughs> Madison reminds me, or Aaron reminds me of Madison Van Watson in her out in that outfit. I guess I can see it a little bit. All right, I'm having everyone take care of themselves, and it's looking like Lazo's not gonna get abducted today. So have him go back to sleep, go to sleep, not back to sleep. Who's playing chess? I thought someone was playing chess. Where's our maid at? We need our maid here. This is kind of dirty. Well, it's really dirty, actually. Oh, oh no, it's Astra playing her peg box. That is what is that noise is. She's gonna have so much, she's gonna be like the super kid in this neighborhood. She's already got all her skills learned, like her peg box is all maxed out. She knows how to use a potty chair. She is just so quick with it. <gasps> Loki stole my newspaper. Damn you, Loki. Buck just broke the sink and now he's jamming off his MP3 player instead of fixing it. Thank you, Buck. Very cool. Oh, Buck. I, he's still a kid in my game. I think I'm going to get him with Jill if they like each other. We'll have to see. Does anyone have any recommendations for a household I can play? Oh, I have lots of ideas. I have lots of ideas. How long you got? <laughs> How long you got, Veronica? Veronica, your name stands so... It stands out because it's like purple against yellow it's purple against yellow so it really stands out what did she not oh my gosh i just put that in her hand i did not mean to do that uh, put astra in there yeah they are like the same age aren't they yellow names rise up they stand out a lot more than other names do i will say it's easier to get like noticed i will i i gotta say I think my name is Pink. What is my name? What is my name? Oh, it's Pink. Yeah, it's Pink. <clears throat> Katie's is orange. I think green is the hardest because it's dark and like I have my chat on like a dark background. Hmm. <clears throat> 
Veronica wants a storyline. Um, I always like a I like I always like an affair if I want a little bit of drama in my game. Usually Sims 2 just brings the drama just automatically, so normally I don't have to like try anything. I don't have to try anything. Light green. Yeah, light green stands out. I think the worst is like the dark green. The dark green is hard to see, but the light green is fine. Orange is a little bit hard to see, but not the hardest. I think dark purple is actually the hardest to read, maybe. Okay, so I don't want to play the whole rotation. Oh, I got to turn child support off for PT. Turn off child support because we don't we don't take child support from PT because it just doesn't make sense. Okay, but I think I'm going to stop here because in the next stream, I really want to get nervous and Pascal marry. We don't have enough time to do it now because Pascal wants to throw like a whole party and I got to find a wedding venue for them and everything like that. I actually might do it at this house. It makes most sense to do it just here. I might just do that. Yeah. So um, in the next stream, we are going to get Pascal in nervous Mary and then move on to the next household in this rotation, which is actually, let's take a look, see here, the Spectre family with Ophelia and Johnny. Yeah, so that'll be fun. They're probably going to get married as well. Oh, this is other teens. They're adults now, not teens. OK, so I will catch you guys all next stream for the marriage between nervous and my necklace is like backwards. That's how does that happen? I've been sitting here the whole time. My, I even wore like my little star necklace. Did you guys see that? Look, it has little stars on it it's for my strange town today. Yeah, next stream. Oh, shoot. Next week is not going to be Strange Town, so don't expect Strange Town. Next week will be Pleasant View. And Malachi will be right here, probably. Like, right right here. Right there. Like, half on screen, half off screen. And he'll, he'll be complaining that it's warm. He always complains that it's warm at my house. And then I have to give him this. And then he has to fan himself just like this. <laughs> all right, guys. I will see you all next Saturday for Pleasant View. I don't know who we're playing. But the stream after that, then we'll have Nervous and Pascal's wedding. So yeah, I will see you guys all next Saturday, 7 p.m. EST, 7.15 EST. You're probably around that time. So yeah, thank you guys all for coming. See you then. Bye.